welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be doing a shoot with me or how i take my depop photos or whatever that's the point of the video before this video gets started i would really love it if you guys would subscribe if you feel like it but you know subscribe because it's like free and at the end of the day why not you know or, <gasps> you're lying there's a moth in my room It's like, if this thing starts flying, I'm gonna have to go crazy. So yeah, this is how my Depop photos looked before. And the lighting wasn't the best. I tried different areas of my house, like the backyard when the sun is out. I tried the garage. Well, I haven't tried the garage yet. We're actually gonna be trying the garage in this video. But I tried my backyard and I tried my bedroom. The lighting is just very like not far back enough because my room is kind of small. So we cleaned out the garage. So now I have a lot of space in there to be able to shoot. Um, I only have this ring light I usually shoot with and like a mirror and a lamp to reflect from the sun. I don't know. I just be doing crazy stuff to get the shot and the shot still don't be there. But now, I ordered something else. I ordered a, I got a package from Amazon and I ordered a umbrella light. So I already have this tripod laying around my house. So all I bought was the adapter to the ring light. Like I bought the light bulb like this. Let me take this out. I'm guessing this is, let's not guess, let's just open it up. So I have to get like one of those screw parts to go here and then I connect this here. The bulb will go here and the umbrella will go through this thing here. So, and it came with, it came with two. I was expecting one, but it came with two. So if I ever need another umbrella light, I just have to buy another bulb. Get that side. Oh snap, if this has two light bulbs, this is lit. Come on now, tell me why it comes with two light bulbs. Now I have two umbrella lights. This is the light. In the morning, I will be back because I will not be shooting tonight for my Depop, but what I will be doing is prepping the clothes for the shoot tomorrow, picking out the outfits, everything that I want to go with it. <laughs> Guys, I just finished the umbrella light and the lighting on the umbrella light is so unbelievably beautiful. Like literally it's so much softer than the ring light. And I have two of these, but I need to fix this other stick thing so I could put the other one up. But point is, it's literally beautiful. I am in love with how it makes my skin look. So happy about this investment. If you guys want this light, I'll leave it down in the description box below. And sorry for talking so loud. Bro, I just got a breath the whole vlog. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's hard. Before I take my Depop pictures, I like to do my makeup just to give the picture an extra oomph. Like, it makes the clothes look better. It makes everything look better. It just makes it a whole look, a whole vibe. You just become a different girl. So I feel like if you do take Depop pictures, doing your makeup would not be a bad idea, you know? I mean, that's if you put your face in the pictures because I see a lot of people putting just the clothes only okay so this part of the video i'm just putting my backdrop up you can use anything really you can use a wall you don't have to have this backdrop thing like i do i got mine from amazon um i want to start getting creative and taking pictures in different places it doesn't always have to be a backdrop or it doesn't have to be this you can switch it up to your liking and just make it you you know okay so let's get to the shooting now when you first open your camera you're gonna see at the bottom the number saying 4.1 you want to click that number and make it square this, the option is going to say square, but after you click it, it's going to say 1.1. You want to shoot in square mode because basically if you don't, you're going to have to go in and crop it later because Depop uploads the picture in square mode. So that's my first tip. My second tip is getting a remote because for me, I used to video myself 
and then at the end i would screenshot which shots look best but i i like doing that really was not the best way for me because i would have to go in later crop it do all this extra work so getting the remote would be a really good investment i got my remote off of amazon from here you have your lighting and backdrop set up you have your selfie remote all you have to do is have fun move like make the clothes look good honestly try different lighting don't get discouraged i feel like you should try different lightings try different things these pictures came out great but the ones before this didn't so i'm just gonna keep trying and keep experimenting and i will be documenting this journey yeah. Okay guys, so update while I'm shooting. Um, all the pictures are coming out super great. I love everything. The vibes are great in here. Well, let me turn off the music. Yeah, because we don't need to get copyrighted. Like I was saying though, the pictures are coming out great. It's just a good vibe, good night. So I'm gonna finish taking pictures in all these. And since it's like, everything's coming out so cute, I might just go get some more things that I wanna take pictures in simply because everything's already coming out so cute i might as well i might as well keep going it's a good vibe might as well keep going so for the rest of the night i just ended up taking more pictures um unfortunately i didn't get to get a good ending of the video but this is it so thank you guys so much for watching i hope this video helped you out anyway please subscribe make sure you like and comment some things you want me to do Thanks for watching. Bye.